Welcome back to the MLS Review Show. Chivas hope to continue their playoff push at the expense of Dallas. The Goats were unbeaten in five and were bolstered with the long-awaited return of Alejandro Moreno from international duty. Justin Braun's three-touch hat-trick last week meant Robin Frazier would have plenty of firepower to bring to Frisco. Dallas needed a win to keep pace with a Galaxy, but perhaps they were in danger of slipping after a hard-fought victory in El Salvador for the CONCACAF Champions League. Shellis Heinemann would have to keep his side focused in order to get the most out of a home match against Chivas. Bobby Ryan and Steve Jolly were at Pizza Hut Park for the Sunday matinee. We're underway here at Pizza Hut Park. It's a sweltering evening. Left-footed service from Shea. Heath Pierce is there, but now collected by Ruben Luna. Back for Marvin Chavez. Shot to fucking. And it's in the goal. Ruben Luna doing an incredible job maintaining possession and finding Chavez. Chavez with the first time strike. The approach. Vilar, right-footed service. George Chavez. Well, George John doing everything he can to at least get ahead on it. This is Justin Braun. Braun, right footed to death. His right footed attempt was powerful. There's FC Dallas in the counter attack. There is a player down for Chivas USA. It looks like it's Simon Elliott. And now Marvin Chavez, left foot attempt. Dallas continued to attack and nearly paid dividends. Chavez doing a good job cutting it to his left foot. Looking at the reserves. For Chivas USA on the other side, Zach Thornton, the goalkeeper, Francisco Mendoza, Marcos Mandaini, Alejandro Moreno, Paulo Nagamura. Left footed strike from Martin. Correct save falls for Chavez. The flag is up. And there's a good look at it. Be a phenomenal camera angle that August, September time because all the games become so vitally important. The three points are critically important tonight and FC Dallas has secured them. A sigh of relief on the face of head coach Shellis Heinemann. Exchange of pleasantries between the two managers. Well tonight behind a 26 minute goal by Marvin Chavez, FC Dallas finds their 12th victory of the campaign. The East has a new leader as Columbus has jumped the Union. Sporting, Houston and DC are keeping it tight for the last playoff spots while New England proved that even the bottom of the table won't be beaten easily. Out west, LA and Dallas pulled away from the pack. Seattle and Real Salt Lake dropped points, but the top half of the west are still safe bets for the playoffs. Look for the expansion sides to now play the spoiler as postseason hopes slowly slip from their sights. While Thierry Henry and the Red Bulls were busy winning the Emirates Cup, the race for the Budweiser Golden Boot saw Landon Donovan tally two but it's still too early to count on Breck Shea, Charlie Davies, and last year's winner, Chris Wondolowski. As we head into August, several games get national attention. On Wednesday, Portland looks for revenge against LA at 10.30 p.m. Eastern on ESPN2. Then Fox Soccer Night in America has the Friday night clash between Colorado and Columbus at 9.30. TSN in Canada is where to find DC hosting Toronto on Saturday at 7.30. In other action around the league, KC and Real Salt Lake face off on Wednesday, while New England look to get back to form against Chivas on Saturday. Later that night, the Union battle Houston with huge playoff implications. The top teams in the West square off as LA hosts Dallas. Then it's San Jose versus Portland with three points a must for both sides. And don't miss Barcelona concluding the Herbalife World Football Challenge on the ESPN and Univision networks. That's all for week 20 of the MLS Review Show. As we push for the playoffs, remember to visit MLSsoccer.com for full coverage of all the news in Major League Soccer.